Food that is chewed in the oral cavity, then swallowed, ends up in the stomach where it is further digested so its nutrients can be absorbed in the small intestine. The salivary glands, liver, gallbladder, and the pancreas aid the process of ingestion, digestion, and absorption. These accessory organs of digestion play key roles in the digestive process. Let's go through each one. There are six salivary glands located around the oral cavity, which secrete saliva. Saliva is 99% water, but also contains enzymes and proteins that lubricate the oral cavity and begin chemical digestion of food. There are three pairs of salivary glands and two ducts on either side of the oral cavity. The liver is one of the largest organs in the body, and it is continuously producing bile. This yellowish-brown fluid aids chemical digestion by emulsifying fats in the duodenum. Bile flows out of the liver into the right and left hepatic ducts, into the common hepatic ducts, and toward the small intestine to help with digestion and the absorption of fats. The gallbladder is a green pear-shaped sac about 10 centimeters or 4 inches long that stores and concentrates excess bile secreted by the liver. Bile is released by the gallbladder as needed into the small intestine. The pancreas secretes pancreatic juice, a mix of digestive enzymes, water, buffers, and electrolytes produced by acinar and epithelial cells. Pancreatic juice drains through the main pancreatic duct into the common bile duct and then into the small intestine. There, it buffers stomach acids and breaks down protein, fats, and carbohydrates. To learn more about your anatomy, visit visiblebody.com learn.